Hi, in this video, I'll explain how you can automatically reply to a Facebook comment via Messenger. Before showing you how to do it, I'll show an example. Imagine this is your page and there's a customer who's commenting on one of the Facebook posts. I will comment hi over here. And within few seconds, I should get a message through Messenger. Here you go. Here's the message. To achieve this, you have to go to www.wisebulb.com and register yourself. Once you register, you will be taken to a page where you can create the actual workflow. If not, you can go to create your own flow and type Facebook pages, select the trigger application and select Facebook Messenger. That's the app action application and then click on create a flow. First step is to select all the trigger integrations. So click on setup. Select new comment. Once that's done, you will have to select an account. Since I already have an account, these are already there, but I can even add more accounts. This is basically my Facebook account. It'll ask for the permissions of pages and other permissions which is related to creating this workflow. I will allow Facebook to give access to Visible for all these permissions. I'll select my latest account and click done. This part is the trigger that is done. Now I'll get to the actions part, which will actually trigger a messenger message. The first step is already done. I'll get to the second step. I'll save this as is. Now I will again add my Facebook account here. It's a repeat of the previous step. I'll again give permissions to all the pages. Once that's done, I will give access to the latest app that I have added. The final step is to customize the messenger message. Here I'll type the message that I want our customers to see. I can even customize by adding the name of the person. For example, I am Prashant who is commenting on a Facebook page. I will be replied to by saying hi Prashant. So you can select any of the custom fields over here. I will select name. Hi, my name will come over there. There are other fields like this. I'll ignore this and then click on save. Then I'll save this flow. I'll give it a name. Something that I can recognize it with. Once this is done, I'll click on continue. I will pause my earlier flow, which I showed at the beginning of this demo. Now I'll go back to my page and I'll put a comment over here. And then we'll wait for the message to come. After a few seconds, a message will be triggered, which should include my name. Yeah, I got a message now. This has hi Prashant BN, which included my name at the beginning, like we had customized the flow. Now I can get back to the platform Visible and check how many actions have been triggered for this particular workflow. If you see one task executed, I can even pause this flow. I can edit this flow and change the custom message that I sent using the messenger. 
I will add additional fields. I'll first say hi, my name or the person who's commenting their name. And I'll add a few more custom fields. For example, your comment was received at a particular time. And then I'll save it. Once it is saved, I'll unpause this flow. And I'll get back to the page and I'll comment on the same post again. Now this time I should receive another message that will include my name along with time in it. So this way you, could, you can customize the message that you're going to send to every customer in a different way. Here I got the new message as well. Thank you for watching this demo.